All right, so grab this candle. When you put it there, it's going towards the door. There's a, there's a gap right there, but even this is way worse. Look at that. That's a ton of air coming through the door. And we gotta stop that because when it's so cold out, we don't need all that cold air coming inside the house. The stuff that we're gonna put on here is a, it's like a foam and those are the dimensions. And so the, the goal is just to take up that gap. It's relatively inexpensive. We're just gonna give it a try and see how it works. It just has adhesive, self-adhesive on the back of it. So we'll just cut it to length and put it on. Here we go, just peeled it back and that this side right here is pretty sticky. So we just peel that back. And stick it on the edge. It's got a, it's really got a nice feel to it. It's very soft. Peel it off and push it up the door bit by bit. And the reason we're putting it on the lower half of this door is I think the door is probably not super square in the frame and that's why it's letting get air in on the bottom. So we're just gonna try this like so. Seems pretty good. And then we cut a section away down here on the bottom. We're gonna do the same thing. Measure and cut. It peels away nice and easy. Yeah, sometimes that happens. And there you see. Here's the new and this is the old. But this is this area right here is where the gap is. Well, that was pretty simple. Now let's give it the uh, we'll give it the candle test. All right. So when we started the first time, remember we had this candle here, and it was sucking air back towards the door as the hot air left, and that's fine. And this was the this was the real scary, sketchy part. So it feels remarkably better. And you can see the candle's not getting blown out like it was before. So that's a pretty simple fix. Uh, didn't cost, I think it was $10. Certainly have plenty left over in case I need to redo it if it peels off or whatever. But I think we'll just give this a try. Uh, this is definitely much improved. Hope this video helps. Thanks all for watching. We'll see you in the next video.